What's going on YouTube? Happy Sunday. It is, well, it's going to be Sunday when you guys see this video. I am making this video a little bit early. I am going to be gone this weekend, but I wanted to make sure you guys have some stuff to watch. Uh, so this is my normal mail day video. I'm making it on uh, Thursday though. So I just finished watching the NFL draft or at least the first round. Uh, so this is coming a little bit later to you guys. But with that, I mean, I'm I'm pretty happy with the Vikings picks. We got Justin Jefferson, and we got a corner at pick 31. We traded down, and I am pumped about that. Uh, so we got some more late round draft picks. We will see how it all turns out. But I I like the Justin Jefferson pick. I think we did good there. I've got my uh, my Iowa State guys in the background. Sadly, none of them are going to get drafted on uh, you know Thursday or Friday. Uh, well, none got drafted today or on Thursday, but. Probably not on Friday, uh, but we got my my PC of my Cyclones with those booklets in the back. I love it. That one's out of 10, out of 49, out of 99, I believe. Let me just double check. Yeah, 99 for the David Montgomery. And I do have another Butler out of 49 as well, but let's get to some of the mail. Uh, so with me making the video early, I did not get all the mail I normally would have got. Uh, you know, like, I'm not going to have it for... Uh, Friday and Saturday's mail. Uh, so if you guys did send something or if we made a trade, that'll probably be in the next mail day video next week. Uh, so a little bit smaller mail day today. So let's just get to it. This was a trade, I believe, with Paul. Let's see what we got. We have this nice Hakeem Butler, the purple parallel from Score. I do not have this. Uh, so that is pretty sweet. Got a nice little butler. I believe I traded that. What did I trade? Might have been that Cam Newton jersey card. But didn't have this yet, so that's cool to get that purple parallel. Then a uh, couple things. We got an Al Nazard right here. Jordan Howard, Al Nazard. And then I traded uh, right here. Oh, I got to open this bad boy up. Let's see. So today's question is going to be, do you guys enjoy the draft that you had so far? Well, I guess it'll be over by now, but what do you guys think of your team's draft? I want to know what you guys think down below. Uh, there were some surprising picks on day one with the Packers trading up. That was kind of crazy. Uh, but, you know, there, it's to be expected, and I always enjoy it. So let's see what we've got here. I believe this is a... Jordan Howard patch card, and I have a, uh, a buddy, Cody, who collects these. And so, Jordan Howard patch card right there, alma, mar alma mater from the uh, the Hoosiers right there. So, I will be throwing that into a sleeve. Always fun making trades within the community. So, there we go. And uh, this was actually one of my favorite ones I got, because I did not have this score purple parallel. So thank you for making that trade with me. Let's uh, let's keep it moving. I mean, really, we only have like three three packages. I guess I'll do this one first. This was this was another trade. This is from David. All right, I want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Here we go. This is a, a pretty good one. I was excited to have these come in. Looks like you threw in a couple extras. Very nice, of you, David. Because uh, I definitely don't remember seeing this David Montgomery. That is sweet from Select Rookie Selections. I'm gonna move that over to the front. We have David Montgomery right there. We have a Hakeem Butler Elite Series Rookies with beautiful shine. A Hakeem Butler the Prism. Uh, what do they call this? I can't remember the name of the parallel, but it's gonna be out of 175. Four of 175. And then we have this. I did not have a single one of these. This is sweet. Hakeem Butler, I believe this is from Panini Day. 21 out of 25 right down there. Not bad. Got a little Panini logo there. Kind of cool. Yeah, Panini Day 2019, you can see on the bottom. And then we have a Spectra. Look at that. Spectra RPA. Going to be numbered out of 99. I don't think I had this one, though, and that just looks awesome. So, three-color patch, chunky patch, RPA of Hakeem Butler. We're adding some more autos of them, so always enjoy that. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of close to 200, which is a little insane. Uh, but, you know, 
Gotta keep yourself busy somehow. Uh, but here we go. Let's go into this package. All this was an eBay buy. I couldn't help myself. I got a good deal. This is uh, one of my first National Treasures cards. David Montgomery. Looks like a chunky patch. 27 of 32. I believe this might be the first off the line ones. I can't remember. Uh, but a red parallel. 27 of 32 with those two very nice patches. Again, couldn't help myself. I, uh, it went for a good price, so uh, I just kind of picked it up. All right, we have two more packages. This one is a eBay buy, Rookie Reflections, a Andy Isabella, and a Hakeem Butler, 5 of 15 from Illusions, the dual patch, dual auto, chunky patch for Butler, so that's sweet. Uh, just another Butler autograph. I was very, very excited that the Cardinals did not pick up CeeDee Lamb or any other wide receiver. I was a little worried that Butler might just get cut immediately or something uh, before I ever got to see him play in the NFL. So hopefully, I still have hope, fingers crossed, that I will get to see Butler play this year. Uh, really hoping for it and looking forward to it. Uh, so they got a steal with Simmons, honestly, in the first round. So uh, let's go. The last one, this was an eBay buy, but I believe the eBay seller actually knew who I was, or I, I had made a deal with him previously on Instagram, and he saw that I won the item. So uh, let's see what we've got. All right, here we go. Hey Vikings95, just writing this to say thank you and keep up the vids. You're a tr you're truly a gem to this community as you make uh, as you make vids. Not many others make eBay lots, repack boxes, etc. Uh, I oh I added two Anthony Millers to remind you I'm not gonna read it. Who is the next best wide receiver in the NFC North and which team is the best in the NFC North? All I gotta say is uh, standings wise, the past couple of years. Uh, disagrees with that. So I guess they did win. What was that? How many years ago did they win the division? I don't know. But he's a Bears fan. Uh, so let's, uh, let's see what we, uh, what we've got here. I, I purchased an Alan Lazard card. So, oh man, he threw in, he threw in an autograph of Anthony Miller, rookie of the year contenders. Oh geez. That's a Bears fan. Ugh. But here's the card I traded for. Alan Lazard, Touchdown Kings, uh, not too bad. I don't believe I had this, and that's why I'm pretty sure I picked it up. Or maybe it was just a good price. I can't remember. But, and then another Anthony Miller. Oh, man. He's just throwing Anthony Miller in my collection. He made it on video. Uh, I do appreciate it, though, man. That These are kind of cool cards. I love Unparalleled. Uh, that does look sweet. So, thank you for the extras. I, I definitely never expect that, especially when buying off eBay. Uh, cause I most of the time assume people do not know who's buying. Uh, but him and I did make a deal in the past. So this is, uh, this is the Bears are outnumbering not even a Viking. It's a Packer. So really this, this lot had one Packer and two Bears and no Vikings. So, <laughs> uh, but thank you very much. And then that is a sweet Lazard for my, uh, my Lazard collection. Another one. I think I'm at, man, what am I at? I can't even remember anymore. Uh, I think it's at like 120 or something for Alan Lazard. Uh, so Hakeem Butler definitely did beat him out. Uh, mostly because he was a bigger name his rookie year. There are more things to collect of Hakeem Butler. Like he has cards in pretty much every brand. Panini really uh, gave him a pretty pretty big following for cards with uh, without even playing a snap in the NFL. Uh, so, you know, maybe I had something to do with that just buying up a bunch of cards initially but who knows either way thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for supporting the channel uh every view does help support it if you guys throw a like down below that means uh that kind of shows me that you're enjoying the content i make so i greatly appreciate that and if you're not subscribed I <laughs> if you're not subscribed i would love it if you would uh so with that thank you guys again so much for watching i hope you had a great weekend and have a great upcoming week I'll see you later.